Thank you. Found you in the center of the stem, center of the plant, center of the tree. Probably more so trees than plants. You wouldn't find this in a milkweed, for instance. Okay, so if we're doing heartwood, then chances are we say sapwood. Okay. So, you could probably correlate it to this. What do you suppose that would mean? What did we say in class? If the heartwood is just that, closer towards the center, and it is darker, what would you presume that sapwood would be then? Okay, so it's lighter in color. So it's near the outside of the stem. Outside of the stem, outside of the trunk, whichever way you want to look at it. Okay, what's another one? Okay, in case you're wondering, bark, the outermost, outermost covering of a tree. Can we erase these smaller ones? Yes. Okay. My handwriting is probably not the best, but do you prefer when I write it? Why is that? Because you can see it. Okay. Not that any of you did anything wrong. You're just too neat. That's all. Okay. And for those of you who are looking at this, I guess you just have to maybe go back and hit pause or something to that effect. Okay. So the bud, okay? What, we did that already? Oh, okay. Someone said bud, I thought. Source, okay. So this is the part of the plant that makes sugars. Okay, so chances are if you're asking source, you're probably looking at sink as well. Okay. That might be hard to see. Okay. So sink. other materials. Uh, okay, so this location where sugars are actually made. Now, if they're being stored, where would that be? In the leaves, the stems, or the roots? Because we said photosynthesis takes place up in the leaves. Phloem will take that tissue in through the leaves, down to the stems, and into the roots to where it can be stored. So we really don't need to write that because we just said that's where materials are stored, in the roots. Okay, is there another one?
sperms. So if it's produced in gymnosperms, where else do you suppose it's produced in? What other type of tree? These are the naked seed producers because gymnosperms reproduce how? Well, you would think so. So they don't get pollinated. So when we think of these, pine trees don't get pollinated. So if they're naked seeds, which they are, how do they reproduce then? Not with seeds. You're going to hit yourself over the head and say, I knew that. How do you know? Just say something. Oh, I just was under the presumption that you had an answer. Because I thought you, I heard you just, just say it. No? Huh? Well, angiosperms, that's true. So gymnosperms is one set, angiosperms is the other, but still, how do these reproduce though? Pine trees, what do they drop that's sometimes annoying? Cones, yeah, that's right. So then, how do the angiosperms reproduce? With what? Seeds, that's right. Okay. Okay, we will stop there. If there's any others that you want to go over tomorrow, we can or will. I'll tilt this over just a little bit so you can actually see it. Okay. So we will catch up to you next time.